They'll be calling you a radical. We got some major breaking news that the lawsuit has been filed. Hands up, don't nuke. The bank bail out on chemo. Then all you armchair activists, you keyboard activists, your words, whatever, anybody who's not all over this, this is the marquee watershed freaking build. The nuclear industry is over globally, globally, without this. This Kumu Como, Tomato Tomato, Snowden Snowden, Dog and Pony Show, 7.6, Bank Bell Out on Chemo is Custer's Last Stand, literally. Literally. It is a scam. I love how they say inside the lawsuit, to bell these out is like belling out the horse and buggy industry after the car. It's even more than that. And then they come back at Fitzpatrick and not Nine Mile Island, not to be confused with Three Mile Island, comes out and says, Point blank, well, we have, it's been ruled by the Supreme Court that we can protect our environment. Ha ha ha, nuclear protected. Are you people insane? We are not that stupid. The dirtiest, filthiest, most disgusting thing, the greatest failed experiment in human history called nuclear energy, a global issue. What's Fukushima? What's uranium tilings? What's a centrifuge? What's freaking nuclear waste stored on site? What's diesel flowing into the Lake Ontario? And they, what's freaking. Every major catastrophe that you could ever dream of. What's Three Mile Island? What's Mayak? What's freaking Rocky Flats? What's San Onofre? What's Hanford? I won't stop there. What's Whip blowing up? Two billion to seal it off. What's Savannah River? Huh? And dirty enough for you yet? Dirty enough? What's leukemia, the mass murder and evil thing? To say this. You think we're this stupid still? You know, this is, and I'm telling you, all activists, every activist, million mass marchers, freaking out, which I've renamed it the Millions Mass March, you know, so maybe I'll go to New York first. We'll rally along this. Um, thank you so much for following this suit. Also, this breaking news, this is a video shot by one of our group, Hippie with a Gun, on the mouth of Columbia. This is, wow, look at these dying dead bees. It's going on, the catastrophe that's going on in Oregon right now and everybody's, California, you're all caught up in this electric cycle that means jack. You know, honestly, by the way, there's a new over-under bet that's getting ready to come out right now. Which one, which will happen first? The Cubs score a run <laughs> or the election's over? Last run they scored was Saturday night, by the way, all you Yankees and Mets fans. I mean, the go ahead, freak, it's out, huh? So, look, this is a big, big deal. Como come up, he's, uh, he's, you know, as I was there this summer, it was 112 degrees. You know, Jean-Michel Basquiat, you know, we did our event, you know, it was so hot. This suit, everybody needs to rally around this. All activists. This is the top of the snake. This, look, this is the major watershed. This is Waterloo on Balco, right here, right now. They're trying, Exelon, the scumbags, Axelrod, Barry Antoinette, let them eat yellow cake, who flew to Brazil, cover up the whole dynamic of Fukushima, the San Onofre lie, the freaking Diablo Canyon lie, Mothers for Peace have filed suit down there. They're cheating. Mothers, look, the only reason Diablo Candy come out and says we're going to shut 2025 uh, uh, is because they've got failed equipment all over, just like India Point. Now, you do know India Point is the only nuclear reactor on the face of the earth that is operating without a license. I want you to drive down 7th Avenue without a license. I want you to go along the, you know, FDR out there without a license, you know. Do whatever without a license. See what they do to you. But you could contaminate and kill the whole freaking world. The gesturing blows left to right. Simply, one word should have been the end of these monsters. Fukushima. Now remember, economically, they draw billions of subsidy price standards at the federal level. You can look at it in these budget. Barack Obama, why on our group, was asked in 2008. Now remember, this is a guy propped up by Exelon. This is Exelon's baby. This still is Exelon's baby. Fitzpatrick announced they're closing Three Mile Island. They're done. You know, they're not economical, they're filthy, they're disgusting, they cause cancer, Fukushima's killing the Pacific Ocean, the catastrophe that's going on in Oregon right now, and California, and this is, is mind-boggling. Wyden went to Fukushima, says the whole world, and everybody's, no one can, they act like Fukushima's over. The greatest year-over-year -year collapse of the salmon in human history, recorded history this year, in Oregon. Salmon go to sea for five years. The great collapse of the salmon. The, there's no bugs. The bugs, the breeze, and even here in Utah, the great bubble that's been pushed over this heat source. Look, simple. You know, we're testing what? For starvation? Fukushima is an ongoing vent pushed in. Nuclear fission from hell. Gamma rays from hell. This is the greatest catastrophe in human history. It killed the plankton. Big fish eat little fish. The krill. 
then the sardines and the salmon collapsed. Then you go right down the chain. Oh, well, more wells were washed up on the coast of California in the 18 months than the previous 300 years combined. An oarfish, once in a lifetime. 14 washed up in eight months. Starving to death sea lions by the hundreds of thousands, by the freaking millions. You know, there's a little one, our friends have been videoing and, and take pictures, and no will only let us put one orange tag on them down there in California. I mean, this is the madness thing to say. And no will sit and tell me over and over, it's not our job. So we've only been up, the tag one's 1,500 re-release. There's thousands, they're all full of leukemia. If you, okay, if this is just pure starvation, 30% of them rescued in the freaking rescue missions, which they'll, I mean, these are private institutions because NOAA won't do their job. The marine biologists won't do their part. None of the media in freaking Oregon will report the freaking salmon collapse. By the way, the crabs season is closed again in Northern. We're on the verge of freaking extinction events for crab, for Northern California, Southern Cal. The Simon Salmon Tournament, 14 fish, 400 fi boats, 400 nautical miles for three days, 14 fish. I mean, this is a catastrophe. This is the greatest ecological catastrophe here. And hippie with a gun. I mean, we've documented. You guys are gonna. I documented all the way. I walked from Mexico to San Francisco. I'm documenting. Oh, what? I mean, you think about the hundreds of thousands of marine biologists in the departments out there. I'm the guy that documents the dead tide pools with no money, full of leukemia. I'm the guy that frequently reports the toxic plume. Look, the acidification. Simple. Simple. When you kill really healthy species and you heal healthy, which is the Pacific Ocean, the healthiest, when you kill them, invasive species move in. What is the invasive spook? Pond scum, kind of like a political theater. It's like in politics. We hate our politicians. The disapproval rating of Congress is the highest in history, yet districts are going to elect 80% re-elect their congressmen. 80% of Congress will be maybe 90. Yet you hate them because people are so ignorant they don't even know. It's like the five is saying, I've always wondered what that thing was. The spent fuel is stored on site illegally in every one of these reactors. They went over capacity in 91. Remember re -vegification? They sent the MOX fuel to Japan. It blew up. You know, now they've made the decision. They're going to bring it back from Savannah River. It's into WIP. Remember WIP? Now WIP in Mexico, WIP blew up. <laughs> they lied. Remember they said oh, it was a salt truck? It was me reporting from the place that built it. It blew up. Now they're going to say they're going to seal it off. They've already moving it. It's on the tarmac in. Los Alamos. All these reactors are over capacity. Swimming pools just stacked up their ticking time bombs. You know, it's like my weapons of mass destruction, a nuclear reactor is a weapon of mass destruction. This is the filthiest freaking cash cow. All these people, these people make gargantuous money. I mean, off the government, and then they just cry and hat in hand. The same fight's going in in the state of Illinois right now. Get involved. This is a major, major. Thank you for finding this law seat. This is a major, major, major marquee event. I call it the bank bell out on chemo. Hands up, don't nuke. You know, so maybe I'll go to New York before I go to the Million Mass Marches. You know, me and the Anthony boys, cousins, those Boston boys, those Samuel Adams, those Boston sons of liberty is the fifth, you know, their little group. The Fairhurst cousins and myself, we did this online. I mean, look what we've, I mean, this is the greatest, I mean, it's a major movement globally. You know, just a group of us started this thing, you know. Last year in New York, it was powerful in New York. I loved it. There's some great activists out there, some grassrooters. We're not keyboard activists. We're not armchair of activists. We're out in the street. We're, you know, we mingle. We, we make things happen. We got San Lafre shut down. Without us, San Lafre's never shut down. We got the, I mean, we got them on the ropes, this small group. You know, we rope a doped them. It's time. You know, so maybe I'll go to New York and we'll organize an event, you know. Hands up, don't nuke. Bank bell out on chemo. Thank you so much for uh, this lawsuit and we'll rally around you, a small group of real activists. And, you know, I woke anonymous and, you know, they're on this. They didn't know, you know, they know. I woke them up, you know, when I was full of leukemia, when I gave that inaugural speech of the Million Mass March on the front of the White House. You know, they woke, they're fantastic. It's a small group, but that's all we need, right? The French Revolution was started with what, seven guys, one was a kid. What about the American Revolution? You know, first they come, a couple guys. You know, 80% of the population didn't even want that revolution. <laughs> we dressed up like Indians and we threw the fuck thing. I'm Alexander Hamilton at his grave. We do, that's what we've organized. Maybe we'll organize it there again. Maybe we'll do it at the Trinity Church right there. Maybe that's where we'll do it. But we'll kick it around, but we're here for you. You know, just like the USS Reagan case, that's getting ready to go forward. We're waiting for the appellate court. I'll be, I've been there the whole time. I've been there the whole time. And we'll be there, this is going to break their back. 
this is Custer's last stand. Uh-uh. They're done. The greatest felt. What is the definition of nuclear energy? Generational arrogance. The most general. You know what? Kill our children? I hear the voices of my great-granddaughters. Stay in this fight. We got them on the ropes. Let's take them out. You know, these fucking nuclear madmen and all these people in print media and these scumbags that prop up the... Fuck them. You met your fucking match with us. Fuck you. You branded yourself in history, you fucking dirty lying rats. Oh, we're coming. We're coming. Stay in tune.